We are in Katana Clinical Proton Therapy Facility Room, realized in collaboration between INFN, Laboratorio Nazionale del Sud, and Clinical University Hospital of Catania. This is in operation since 2002 and already treated 500 patients affected by different malignant uh, ocular uh, disease. This was not only an occasion for clinical setup, but even for the technological transfer of many different devices, starting from the uh, patient's positioning system to the dosimetry system that has been already transferred to Italian and European uh, industries. We are now in the heart of this center where the machine, the synchrotron that produces the particles is located. This machine that was developed by Knau Foundation together with the National Institute of Nuclear Physics in Italy and CERN in Geneva and GSI in Darmstadt is a machine that is very similar to those that are used for basic physics but studied in particular to treat patients. At my back you can see the cyclotron accelerator, which is a machine of high intensity dedicated to fundamental physics for the production of exotic nuclei. The second purpose of the machine is uh, uh, for application to nuclear medicine. In joint venture with uh, private companies, and uh, the idea is to produce radiopharmaceuticals which uh, can be available for hospital and diagnostic centers. The uh, new technology we developed uh, will uh, allow to uh, small and medium-sized enterprises uh, working in the field of the uh, precision mechanics uh, to fabricate complex accelerating structures uh, for both research and industrial applications. The uh, new technique uh, allows to substitute the brazing procedures uh, in uh, big and expensive vacuum furnaces uh, with a special mechanical join that can be fabricated with the typical techniques of the precision mechanics. Computer resources are becoming increasingly strategic to manage and analyze the huge amount of data produced by our society, the so-called big data, to face today's and future challenges. Here in Bologna, a European supercomputer center, the Technopole, is now being realized, and CNAF will be one of its main players. The Technopole will be a point of reference for many activities, from research to meteorology, from medicine to cultural heritage to industry 4.0.